So today we're going to okay, make brownies. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Okay, so yes, today we're going to make brownies. I just want to say, sorry guys, we have not uploaded it in like almost a month now because we have been trying to upload, but my phone is still not working. I mean, I, I don't think you guys knew that. Sorry, um, that was my fault because I haven't been making videos. <laughs> well, my phone has, for some reason, stopped working and it can't hear when you talk to it in videos and then Allison, I don't know what her plans were with not uploading. I don't but, know well, today we're going to, and we are making chocolate fudge brownies. Brownies. And it will have a special topping to it mm -hmm. <coughs> in this cute <coughs> jar. Mm -hmm. um, okay. So if there's random little cuts in this video, it's probably because I'm checking on what my dog's doing because she's a little uh, rascal. So, so yeah, what you'll need I'm is a, a chocolate fudge 13 times 9 family size. That way you have it for your family or you know if you it's a family it size for you and your friends. So it'll be family size because who knows how many friends you have. Then you'll need two eggs. Yeah. And then you'll need like, a fourth cup of water. Yeah. Yeah. A fourth cup of water, yeah. yeah. Fourth cup of water, and then you'll need two thirds cup two of thirds oil. cup of um, vegetable oil, pure vegetable oil. And then if you want to add the special topping like we are, you are just gonna this need some powdered, powdered sugar. sugar. You can, can just use a spoon. Yeah, but yeah. we just have a cute little shaker that shakes out powdered sugar. So yes. So let's get started. So wait, I'm gonna pause it. This you need to. Okay, so this is the chocolate fudge. Sorry, Allison, cut it. Oh, we have a bowl. I will stop you. Yes, yeah, so you'll need a bowl. And a spoon and um, mixers. You'll need mixers for when you mix it all. You can hand mix this, it just will be a lot more work. You have a hand mixer, and you'll need the mixer, of course. Unless you have one of those cool mixers. Unless that, you have a KitchenAid yeah, kitchen 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 mixer. Too. And then you'll just need to cut open this. And you're going to want to pour your mix into your bowl. And then set your oven to 350. Oh yeah, we forgot to mention that. How do you set your oven? I don't know how to set your oven. That's a stove, little well, honey. Okay. Oh yeah, that's your oven. Okay. Oh wow. Well. Okay. So you're gonna want to get out all the lumps in your brownie yeah, mix. Yeah, do it on It just helps mix it more. And then you're gonna want to create a well in your mixture to hold the moisture. If you guys do not know what that does, it makes it easier to mix when you're using a mixer, especially because there's so much powder. So just create like a little well. I'm gonna adjust the camera angle real quick so you guys can see it better. Oh wait, okay. And now we're going to combine the oil, water, and eggs to this. Okay, I'll be back. Hi. Okay, so we did a close up for this. So, and then you're going to, so I added the <coughs> oil and water. That's the dog. <coughs> Sorry, that's my puppy. Here, one second, I'll get her stop talking. <coughs> wait, which one is it? <coughs> the pause. Okay, sorry about that. Um, here she is, right there. She's annoying. She's so big. And so, yeah, she's not annoying. She's so just you're going to want to crack your eggs. Yes, crack both of them, like the two that you were You crack that egg with one hand? No. And wash your hands. So you don't get oil or egg on anything? Perfect. Okay. Let me dry my hands. Okay, and then what you're going to do is stir it all. So we are just going to use the mixer for this. Okay, so let's get the mixer set up and we'll be right back. Okay guys, we fixed the angle once again so you can see better. But you're gonna wanna start out on low speed because there's so much powder in this mixture. And you're just gonna start mixing your mixture until it's pretty combined. And then you wanna keep moving up until you get to too high. So. And you'll just start getting higher and higher as you keep on stirring. So yeah, we'll be back and just make sure you keep getting higher and higher so you're getting everything mixed and we'll be back when we have it all mixed. So remember every once in a while you want to just take a spoon and go down and scrape all the powder and mixture off the sides of your bowl so you get the egg evenly combined throughout the mixture. And then set that on the plate and then just continue to mix at medium speed. Make sure when you're doing it to stop and like. Okay, so make sure when you stop it, like Allison's just gonna keep going so that way, okay. Um, when you stop it, make sure you lift underneath to make sure you got all your powder out. 
So like there's just a little bit of powder under there, but you can take your spoon and stir that all in so it's not on the bottom. And you're just gonna keep doing this and lift it up so it all gets on the top. And then you'll just go back to mixing it. And then when you make sure all the powder's gone, like off the sides and off the bottom, then you'll be done and we'll be back when it is done. Okay, so our mixture is completely done and you're just going to try to get um, most of the mixture off of your spatulas. It's okay if you have a little bit on there because then it creates a nice little snack for yourself. So okay. now we're going to show you how to prep your pans and stuff. Yes. Okay, so right now I am just going to stir it all with the spoon after it's all done being mixed with the mixer. But you just want to make sure <laughs> and stroke it with the spoon. Stroke. Gentle strokes. Strokes. And look at all that chocolate falling. I'm sorry if I'm making you guys hungry. I'm very, I'm very sorry. So how was your guys' Halloween? Yes, ours was great. We got stacks on stacks. If you go check out my Instagram, which is little under dad. No, wait, yeah. No, just little, little Kate, I think, with an under lesson. No, it's little Kate. Oh, well, anyway, I'll tell you guys the Instagram in the... <laughs> The description below and Allie's. So yeah, and you'll see how much candy we both got. Yeah. Okay. So now I'm gonna switch the angles again, and we'll be right back. So to do this, you're just gonna want some. Either you can use flour for this; it just makes the bottom of the brownies taste like flour. Um, but I'm using or butter, but I'm using just like Pam cooking spray. And I don't think, do we have the actual baking one or is it still raised? Oh yeah, it's still raised. Okay, sorry, I just had to clarify that. So, you're just going to take it and you're going to want to spray your pan. And then, what I like doing, I like taking a paper towel and I like going up the sides and going. You know the best there. part that comes out of this? Is at the end, when your bowl is all empty, you just get to go in with a spoon or your fingers and just slather your mouth <laughs> in it. So, so make good. sure your pan is well coated so your brownies don't stick. Because we don't not want that with this recipe. That is not what we want. That's not good. That's not good, no. Okay, so then what you're going to do is you're just going to set your pan here and get your bowl of your brownie mix. And you're just, I have little holes, slum holes on the side of my bowl, so it makes this job super duper easy. But you're just going to want to pour in your brownie Why mix. Why do you like drop it? in to your thing just and it will it will spread out on its own so you don't really have to help and if you want to much. if you get worried that it won't spread out just take your spoon and you know dash it around slash it around boom 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 yeah and then so i'll just do that when Ali's done just in case i mean i'm not worried i just want you guys to make sure to know this what to do. i know okay so, okay, so now I just have a rubber spatula, and I'm going to... Spatula. Spatula. And I'm going to take the brownie mix, okay? If you're wondering why I'm not doing this part, only because I am over here eating leftover fudge on the little mix of this. Yeah, okay, I'm just going to scoop all of this brownie mix in to this recipe. And you don't want to use a... For ours, the 13 by 9, will you flip the pan or the thing for me, please? What do you mean? Um, could you like flip the box for me? 13 by 9. 13 by 9 is going to be 28 to 31 minutes. Keep your eye on it. And the way you test if your brownies are done or not is if you could stick a knife or a toothpick or something straight through the center of your brownie mix and it comes out 100% clean, no crumbs, because that means it's still sticky, not brownie mix, because we want to cook all that egg through. So, yeah. Um, you're just going to want to try to get as much as the brownie mix as you can out of your bowl to get the most brownies out of this. So yeah, will you pause it, Caitlin, because I can't? <laughs> yeah. Okay, so, ignore that stain on my shirt. I don't know what happened. So next, after you pour all your brownie mix into your pan, see the bowl is pretty much still empty, you're going to just want to tap it on the bench a couple times to get so all the bubbles get out. So all the air bubbles get out. Or you could take airy your spoon and you could just flatten it out so the bubbles kind of go away. Yeah. 
But it's also nice to drop it because it does pop them. So, yeah, just nice and smooth. You want to do this awesome? I don't know. Yeah. And then at the same time you're mixing around, you can drop it so it does get the air bubbles out. Because it's a good mixture to do. You could do like the marble effect, like you know when you're marbling stuff, like cakes, you, where you just like Basically drag your just spoon put your spoon it. in it and just start dragging it around. Yeah. We'll it just helps in the camera. Get all of these air bubbles out and, and smooth out the top of the cake. Or you or the can, brownies, or the cake, anything you really are doing. I think you could do this. You could shake it. I think that just adds more bubbles when you drop it. I don't know, it just keeps getting bigger bubbles. It's because they're coming up to the surface. So I'm just going to soothe it all out. And then we'll hopefully go away. It's all on top. So I'm just going to do the marble effect too. Just a quick. Oh, so I see you get the bigger things. Uh huh. Look how the food. Okay, that's good. That's good for me. Okay, so is it done for eating? Yeah. Great. Right. So now what you're going to do is get the rest of the. I'm going to move the camera angle over there. That's what we're going to do. And don't pause it. It's fine. It's fine, guys. You don't Let's move the camera, shall we? All right, so come with me. Follow me to the oven. Yes, I'm wearing pajama shorts. Don't mind it. So you're just going to set it. If you have a sink right here by your oven, set it's going to nicely place it in our oven. Well, I over here, in the back, and then we're setting the timer for 20 minutes. That's a nice close up right there. Hello, hello guys. Hello. Okay. I got like popcorn in my mouth. You know, I didn't eat it from my popcorn. I know. I look, I look bad. I look, I look white. I look so white. Okay. Come back over here to Allison. Hi. Yes, I know you see my neck bones. It's a uh, very creepy. All right. I know I look I look better far far back. I know. All right. Sorry about that. I'm not eating or anything. Oh. You guys get to see my true identity here. <laughs> Sorry, my head's in the way. I'm scraping the brownie bowl clean. Hey, 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 leave some for me. Yeah, hey, 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 hey. Why are you being so rude? Hey, 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 move. <laughs> move it, honey. <laughs> okay, using a spoon is better. It um, has the nice edges to get out. So basically, set your oven to 350 and put it in there when it's set for you. We'll be back. Larry! <laughs> All right, guys, so then you're going to set your timer, which we forgot to do. No, I already did it. Okay, we have it right there in the microwave. Can't see it, but it's right there. Well, off your soul. So, now, in your free time, watch watch the show. Watch the rest of our videos. Watch our other videos. Do something. I mean, actually, <laughs> you guys don't have to do it because we will be back in a split second for you guys. But we won't be back until 26 minutes. 26 minutes. 26 minutes and 30 seconds. So, we will be back. 26 minutes. Say hello to my little friend. seconds. Look at my And so, we'll be back. <laughs> You're too far. Hold on. You guys are too far. <laughs> we'll, we'll, we'll be back. So while you're waiting, you know, you can eat candy that you got at Halloween. Oh, uh oh, sorry. But I'm going to be taking some Clorox wipes and, <laughs> and I'm gonna clean up the counter so my parents don't get out sorry, of us. Sorry guys, apparently she doesn't know how to wait 25 minutes. <laughs> you should just like go get all your candy and show them. All right. Well, um... Yeah. Okay. <laughs> um. So yeah, you um you can always make your own brownie. Is it just we wanted to get a catch up video, you know? Because we haven't made a video in such a long time that we didn't really have anything to do, and we were doing the dishes like good children do. And we were like, I went, I was putting something away in the cabinet. Somebody just came out right there, 
And I was like, whoa, we have brownies and like brownies and yum, delicious. Yes, so that happened. And we were like, we should make brownies. So yeah, that's how we got to the idea of doing brownies. Um, so this, let me fix this. Um, I tried on the lighting here. I don't know if I did good. That's Caitlin's candy. It's heavy too. Why don't you just like lay the bags up? Don't put the dog on the, <laughs> the counter I just cleaned. Okay. So like, excuse me, excuse me. Sorry, sorry. Oh, sorry about that. Okay. All right, this is my candy. It's a lot, bro. Literally, it's like bags. Like it's, just like take out the bags. Is, everything is in a Ziploc bag. We we sort sorted them out. We sorted them out. Yeah. So I got my. You want to see my Tootsie Rolls? <laughs> my Tootsie Rolls. So there's one bag. Okay. Where's the other one? Here's. Okay. Sorry, they're just all over the place. Here's two bag. Okay. Then there's three bag. There's three bags of Tootsie Rolls. And you know who almost all of them were from? No, not all. Like maybe like a. Like half of them. This were from this me. girl was because oh, I was all. Oh, I don't like the three rolls. And then I got like this many cake guys. But I'm probably starving you guys with all this candy. I'm sorry. But go eat your Halloween candy. Go eat your Halloween candy. Or you're watching this two years but later. But if you already ate it, enjoy the candy that's in your tummy. Okay, I'm sorry. What kid already ate all their Halloween candy? Don't know. Don't know. So we're just going to. What's your favorite type candy of candy? <gasps> It's gone. It's gone. It disappeared in thin air. It just. Okay. So, yes. But I'm sorry. We can't wait 22 minutes okay, to get back to you guys. Like, like sorry. But like, I'm gonna eat a sucker while you're at it. Or like, um, eat some. Uh, let's see where they go. Like, where'd they go? Cookies, human, human cookies. Eat a bag of Mike and Ike's. You know, just Maybe I'll some waffles. Eat a sucker. You know, just eat something. You know. Sorry. So right now we're experimenting to see if there's um, a second topping we can pop uh, some of the brownies. Well, it's the one topping, but it has two ingredients. Yeah. So I think we're gonna leave some of the plain like at the bottom for the people who don't want them, and then I'm gonna put some toppings on some of them. My mom is scabbing for the candy. Did you like to say hello? No? Okay. You can talk. Where's Izzy? One second, Kate, I'm going to change. Just going to make the ingredients. sugar to it, like kind of a lot, but not really a lot. Pretty much like if uh, two parts powdered sugar and probably like one part cocoa powder because we're using unsweetened. It's just natural unsweetened cocoa powder. That's why. Okay. 
Okay, I'm gonna pour try pour this powder. Yeah. Okay, let's try this. Mmm, try it now. So much better. So much better. Because I added more. Mmm, okay. Mm -hmm. I'll be back. Okay, so guys, we made two mixtures. We have a you can't it's see like it. A chocolate. Here, yes. Yeah. 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 So this is a cocoa, a cocoa powder one. You can see the little dust go out. So this is cocoa powder mixed with powdered sugar, and then that's the one we said was regular pine. And then this one's just the powdered sugar. Yeah, just the powdered oh, sugar. Sorry. You may not see. Hello. It. You may not see it, but this one's just the cocoa. Sorry if you can't see it. And then. We are going to do regular brownies, powdered brownies. So I think cocoa powdered brownies. So I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna do. We're and gonna then try to cut it. We have this pieces. tray. We're going to put it on. So yeah. Oh wait, did we tell you how you had to wait for the cookies to be done or brownies to be done cooking? No, we have to wait for them to cool as well. Yeah. Good. And we have thirty seconds. Uh, I'll go check. Yeah. And now we have to wait two more minutes because they would know we're done. Let me see this. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I remember that. You don't need to check it again. No, I'm making sure it's the edges again. You, that doesn't determine anything. Yeah, because sometimes the edges get harder than the middle. Trust me. Oh, right, well, I know that. They're normal like that, but you have to make sure the um, center is cooked. Okay, we'll be right back. Okay, so the brownies are out of the oven. If Caitlin would move, you can see them. They're, they're right there. Yeah. So we're going to let them cool a little bit more, and then we'll come back when we're done. Okay, guys. So this is our setup. We have the plate that we're going to use, like the little cake holder, brownie holder. Whatever, cupcake holder. And it's our powder, powder, our spoon, knife, and of course the main thing the brownie. One extra thing I'm going to use a ruler so we can cut the brownies evenly. Like they had that in STEM. Yeah. Yeah, it's like an exacto, like straight line ruler. This is just so we could cut the brownies evenly um, into equal number of squares. Yeah. So yeah. this is the setup, and we will be back when we have. When we get oh, to sorry, the light for this. So yes. Hello. Um oh, we're gonna we're cutting the brownies now. So yeah, we'll be right back once they're all cut. Okay guys, so they are finally done at like six ten. Yeah, just eat one. Now, like six ten at night. We started at like five, five. So yeah. But that's okay. So now we're gonna take We're just going to be taking them out. And we're going to put them on a plate each section at a time. We have three plates here with four sections, but two sections will be plain, right? Um, I'm confused. I, don't know. I think we're gonna do four each, like four. Oh yeah, like four. Oh yeah. Okay. Oh, so we only need twelve. Yeah. All right. So let's see if we can. Here, just you want me to do we'll do this off camera because it's gonna take a while. So we'll be right. Okay, guys, so these are plain ones, so we're just going to take those out, scoot these over. These will be our two powdered ones. So, we got Allison doing regular powder. I'm going to do cocoa. Cocoa. Okay, so. Oh, so these are my plates in that way. Oh, please don't eat them. Can I eat this? No. It's just a food on the side. Yeah. You eat bacon when I cook it. Okay, okay, sorry about that. Um, so, these are. Oh God. Okay, guys, so I'm just going to just pour the cocoa on it. Cocoa powder stuff. And this is just two parts powdered sugar to about one part um, unsweetened cocoa powder. And it just has a sweet, subtle chocolate taste. Tastes really good. 
You can just cut the back. What? Too much. I won't. And we'll just kind of soothe it out. I know, I'm using my fingers. So no, her, finger, her hands are clean. We washed our hands. Okay, and then just smooth it out so it's all nice and, you know, smooth it out. Okay, so let's move on to the regular ones. So yeah, I know this one doesn't have a lot. You just, I, oh, dang, that was a lot, sorry. That's good, it was so tasty. So set that aside. I got mine now. Um, so I'm gonna make, I need to get this back. I'm going to put them on the plate like that. And I'm going to do the same thing as Caitlin. And just spread the powdered sugar all over them. Like this part you can use a spoon to do. Okay guys, so there's the powdered ones and you can always add more to the person who's eating them. And so we're going to distribute the ones Caitlin's taking and then I will arrange the one I'm keeping. Okay, so I have a trusty cupcake stand, but I'm going to be using it for our brownies here. So I'm technically really, I'm really just going to like stack them in any real way and pattern I feel goes. I'm going a little bit, that's not good. Um, you can really just have fun, be, or be fun with this. You don't even have to add a topping. And you can just leave them plain, like these ones. And I'm just gonna put them on this little tray here. So they're easily reached by my family. And I want to this one. Um, so yeah, just have fun with this. I'm gonna break this one in half. Um, this is, there's no real pattern for any of these types of kind of things. So yeah, so we have brownies. We have our brownies here. And then any little scraps on the plate you can just eat. Okay, um, I'm gonna just throw your plates away. And yeah. So here is our lovely, lovely brownies. And yeah, so waiting for Caitlin to do the outro. She's, um, yeah. So just make sure that if you guys do enjoy these brownies to tell us. I'm gonna just on camera here, cause you know, too lazy to pause. Sorry, I'm back. I'm sorry. We're gonna do a little close up of the brownies. There we go. Hold on, guys. Okay, guys, so here are the brownies. I know they look they look funny. That's okay. That's the best you could do. It's the best we could do, you know, you know. That's actually the one that actually looks like a brownie piece. This one? Yeah, that looks good. It's small. And then if we just Alright, so now it won't get, you know, like, bad. Because there's a sticky lid over here. So, now, the worst part is the cleanup work for everything. But, thank you guys so much for watching, and I hope you enjoyed this video of us making brownies. This took forever. I just hope you guys know that. It took a long time. So, thank you for watching, and hope you guys have a nice week, and hope you had a fun Halloween. And see you guys. Peace. Bye.